This video will demonstrate how to install a standard Leviton dimmer in a three-way application with a three-way switch. We will show this by installing the Leviton DSL06 Decor Slide Dimmer, but these installation instructions also apply to other standard Leviton LED dimmers. Please note that the installation of a digital type dimmer, such as the Decora Smart DW6HD, requires a matching or coordinating remote for a three-way application. Refer to the product's instruction sheet for further information. Please be certain to follow all wiring instructions and diagrams provided with this product. If you are unsure about any part of the instructions, or if you are not comfortable or familiar with working with electrical wiring, contact an electrician. When installing and terminating this Leviton device, have the following tools on hand. A flathead screwdriver, a Phillips head screwdriver, electrician's pliers, a wire stripper, electrical tape, and a handheld voltage tester. Installation takes approximately 15 minutes. The process shown follows general guidelines. Local codes take precedence. This installation is based on two decor switches that are currently controlling the same lighting load. Choose which one of these switches you would like to replace with the dimmer. To begin, turn off the power at the circuit breaker. Now, remove the switch plate and unscrew the existing device from the wall box. Carefully pull the device out until you clearly see the wires. Use the voltage tester to ensure that there is no power present in the box. Be sure to test all the wires in the box. Now we need to identify the common wire. This is the wire that is connected to the black screw terminal on the existing switch. Depending on which switch you are replacing, this wire will either be connected to the line side or to the load side. Use a small piece of electrical tape to label this wire. The remaining two wires are the traveler wires. Next, carefully disconnect all the wiring and remove the existing device. Straighten out and separate each wire so that you can clearly see them and make sure that none of the exposed metal ends of the wires are touching each other. In this example, the following wires are in the wall box. One black wire, which is the common, a bare copper wire, which is the ground, and two traveler wires, one black and one red. Please keep in mind the color of the wires can vary. The hot wire may be black or red. The ground wire could be green or bare copper. If you are unsure, contact an electrician. Make sure the ends of the wires from the wall box are straight and stripped approximately 5 eighths of an inch. If not, you may need to strip them. There are two ways to attach wires to the dimmer. The first is by wrapping the wire clockwise around the screw and tightening it. The second is by placing the wire under the screw terminal plate and tightening the screw. We will be placing the wires under the screw terminal plate. Begin by inserting the bare copper ground wire under the green terminal screw on the dimmer and tighten the screw firmly. Next, take the common wire, the one marked with a piece of electrical tape, and insert it under the screw terminal plate marked BK and tighten firmly. Now, connect the first traveler wall box wire to dimmer screw terminal plate marked RD and tighten firmly. Finally, remove the insulating label from the dimmer and connect the second traveler wire to the remaining screw terminal plate and tighten firmly. The device is now terminated. Before mounting, we are going to test the dimmer. Restore power at the circuit breaker and then carefully hold the dimmer. Move the slider control lever to the highest position and press the top of the Decora rocker. The light should turn on to the brightest level. If the lights do not turn on, refer to the troubleshooting section of the instruction sheet. Turn off power at the circuit breaker. Complete the installation by carefully positioning all the wires to provide room in the wall box for the dimmer. Mount the dimmer into the wall box with the mounting screws, attach the wall plate, and turn the power back on at the circuit breaker. Your Leviton dimmer is now ready for use.